It is such an exciting time for me right now because I have two full albums coming out around my birthday. We're gonna be setting up for Xenary Heroes Troubleshooting and Triple S Assemble 24. It is so exciting for a multitude of reasons. Like, first of all, my men are coming back. Like, hello, that's always exciting. And this Triple S debut with OT24 will be the first Jubin release, which means she has photo cards. Like, I've waited five months for this moment. I already made a list of. Oh! I already made a list of the fillers I need to make. Um, I haven't cleaned any pops for troubleshooting because they tend to do pops in the same outfit as the album cards. But I did join a group order for the closed beta MD stuff. I think I'm going to buy the diary as well because it's so freaking cute. For Assemble 24, I claimed two paws already. Um, Cause I'm crazy and I can't freaking wait to have a Jubin photo card in my hand. Like, oh my God. I just claimed two. They released more last night. I think they're like all showcase cards. Or something, but okay, we're gonna start with troubleshooting meetings. Oh my god, and they're not doing units anymore. Like, what the hell? Like, I know I'm behind, but come on, I, I wanted more. Going on with the pop thing for x Heroes, I think I also just want to wait for the pops that I know will be harder to get later on. This is ugly. Yeah! For Live Lock, they did a JYP shop BC. And that pop is like easily the hardest to get out of all of the paws that they did for live lock. Like I can't find that one anywhere. Like you think MMT squish pop is impossible? Girl, I can't find that one anywhere. I have it, but like what if I wanted the other ones? So I'd rather wait for that in MMT because MMT typically give them something fun to do. And I prefer that. So, I'd rather just wait. The title being called Young, Shy, and Stupid. What in the mix scenario? Like, I think they just do these things for me. They also did a platform version, and there's 12 cards. I'm not writing out all the freaking cards, so we'll just do. Drop Nope, just shooting. Well, okay. And then there's like a lenticular QR card. Ah! They're so unique. Oh my god, I love them. I did a group border for the platform cards. Not cards. The actual like platform version. Oh my god. Because I did it for Enmix, so I knew that I, like, I wanted to post for the boys as well. I wish they did more for the concert because like usually the concert was just pretty good but i guess now they were like no you guys don't get shit like why would i need a silicon band did anyone else have an obsession with hot topic like the bands that they would give with like the band names on them i had so many of those i should wear them again no those shits, oh my god, when you wear them in the summer, Jesus. Um, there's like a light stick. What? <sighs> Whatever, girl. I also have unfortunate news about the pouch photo cards. They're doing hearts, which is very cute with the actual, like, full set because they all, like, align, like, Gunsu and G Jisook and Odi and, um, obviously dog foods but the girls also have like the heart photo cards 
it was a pop during an expert go and literally they all did it like this way except for Jiwoo who did it this way only one is going this way so unfortunately my ults hate me and their hearts don't like match up moving on to assemble 24 there are three versions so there's one object per version you get one object in the album which everyone is very mad about rightfully so but also when have they ever given us multiple objects in an album i don't think they would start with this just because there's 24 members like i understand why everyone is upset you know because like okay it's a little unfair to get one object when there's so many members but like everything about k-pop is capitalistic <laughs> so obviously they're going to give you the least amount of objects possible so you will buy more albums like i think that's just like k-pop common sense i don't know <laughs> we literally thought that there weren't gonna be objects at all let's let's cheer up a little <laughs> i don't know the version names i don't think they have names do they have names oh god do they have names i don't want to check olivia tweeted that there's like over 200 inclusions for ot24 at least i think it was 200 it was like 240 something, I think, which is like absolutely insane. Jubin's um, cream objects drop tomorrow, I believe. Like I'm being fed so well right now, guys. It's kind of fun in Jubin Nation. Maybe if you guys woke up. <laughs> Aside from the objects, we also get IDs, which bitch, I love me some IDs. Like, oh my God, I can't believe I'm gonna have a tiny picture of Jubin. And I'm gonna have three tiny pictures of Jubin. Like, this is crazy, dude. I think being away right now is, like, comparable to that one picture of the guy, the two guys on the bus, and one is looking out the window, and there's, like, sun and stuff, and then the other guy is looking out the window, and there's just a mountain, and he's, like, sad. Like, I'm the happy one, and the rest of Waveville is, are the sad ones. Literally, no one is being positive about anything, and you're just here like, I'm just happy to be here. <laughs> it was a struggle getting through that week of the glow girls being revealed. The dread that filled me when I woke up and saw that there was a rumor <laughs> that um, Sola was an O10. Oh my god, an O10 liner. O10? 2010. Oh my god. I was like, I kind of just don't want to open Instagram today. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. This is gonna be a bit controversial. And I should not be saying it, but also I don't give a fuck. I completely understand everyone's outrage with debuting minors in K-pop. Like, I get it. And I don't think it should be as normalized as it is. However, I don't think Waves really reserve the right to express their dislike for minors being debuted in the group when there have been minors in the group since the second member. No matter at what point in which you stand, unless you stand like when Soyeon was revealed, even then, at no point when you stand would it have been lost on you that the whole concept is that we don't know who is coming next. The whole point is that we just don't know. And I don't think we could have just left it up to wishful thinking that there won't be more minors in the group. Everyone is right in being worried about how they'll be treated, but I don't think Waves realize that they are directly contributing to the criticism that the minors will get simply just based on their age. I have seen awful things being said about the minors and like it may not seem like it's really that harsh. Every single wave just tends to have like a high mind when it comes to these things so no one really understands like what they're saying but pointing out that the minors have low object sales 
and then be mad that the group picture for assemble 24 was an object sale order like you're just being a hypocrite because you're pointing out the same thing that the company is pointing out by doing the group picture that way saying that they shouldn't debut more minors because they contribute less object sales compared to the adults of the group is just is the same fucking thing not to mention people literally try to boycott jubin i literally had to like quote retweet someone and be like no jubin sells so many objects haha ha. jubin sells the most objects she has her own tag like on twitter for like her fans to like like talk to her and stuff like she goes on twitter the possibility of her seeing that is literally horrifying like she's been here for like five months and you guys are saying this stuff about her like why like what does it do for you to back up your point that we need adults and triple s like oh my god like she's already here just suck it up <laughs> I don't know what the symbol card means. I don't know if it'll have Jubin's face on it, but it's member specific, so I'm just gonna get it anyway. <laughs> um, let's set up for the boys first. I can't believe I have more on all photo cards to collect. <laughs> I can't believe it. I literally waited so freaking long and I was like getting worried because the boys were the only ones telling us like what anything oh wait, what like like, Jion told us the date, and Jungsu told us that it was a full album. What's happening? What's, what's going on there? I don't... Yeah, like I said, I wish they had done more, but... I can't really complain when it saves me money, I guess. We'll do the mirror cards, I think, for this page, because there's only going to be, like, two cards on it. I think I'm going to put the stickers on this page as well i think it would look cute we'll do the platform cards and then i think for the qr card i'll put it on a page by itself and then put the pops right after it as i get them oh why do i have an extra page oh my god i did it wrong but like i'm literally not gonna have any freaking space for another album i don't know what to do because like i like him in an a5 i don't like him in a a4 like i i tried it twice i just don't like it hopefully this will flatten out and hopefully oh oh we're screwed <gasps> Nian, <gasps> Shinri, <gasps> Yuyun, <gasps> Ju. Oh, okay. I didn't even realize that it was 11. <gasps> oh my gosh! <gasps> oh my gosh, you look so pretty. Uh, oh my god, guys. <laughs> okay, anyway, this is my triple S binder. But honestly, it's mainly gonna be for Jacob. I still have this? I thought I sold this. Oh, oh, okay. How many pages do I need? Um, we'll just do three for now. Me thinks. So this will be for the visual cards. There we go. This binder, the rings are kind of small, but I think it'll be fine. Cause I don't think Jubin's gonna have that many, you know, like releases per year. So it's fine. Yeah, it looks a little like, weird because there's only three i think i'm gonna put the symbol card here i don't know i'll have to see like what i like but i think it'll fit in here we'll do it like this because i'm sure that i'm gonna claim more like i'm literally like i have to like stop myself from claiming them because i'm just i just can't freaking wait i think that's cute I just like don't know what to put here, but maybe they'll do like an ID size palm. Oh my god, there's one palm that I want so bad. They're doing like wrong, okay? I want it so bad. Okay, I think mainly they'll be in like black and white, so I think I'm just gonna like stick with that theme. Me thinks I have 
has so many, so it's, it's perfect. For the normal objects, I think I'll do these ones. People sometimes ask me where I get these. I make them myself. There's like a Tokidoki origami book. So I bought that and then like I just cut them down to size. I'll make fillers for this too. Cause the visual cards they pretty much like fit in this size. But just to like make it look better, I think. But yeah, that's everything. I cannot freaking wait for this to come out. Like, oh my god. Like, it's gonna be the best day of my life. Please cheer Jubin on along with Heyrin and Yeonji and <laughs> like everyone else, please. I am so sweet soybean.